the state is pushing for parents to get their kids vaccinated while giving an update on the outlook for COVID hospitalizations for adults. State officials did so in their weekly COVID briefing. News 13's Jackie Kent is here with more. Kim, with the return to school in person, the test positivity rate for kids ages 5 to 17 is on the rise. Health, health officials say they want to see more testing of school aged kids. We're working closely with our, our uh, public education department. We want to uh, work on collecting better data to help us discern school associated cases uh, amongst children versus uh, kids who, who are getting infected outside uh, of the, the school environment. The only age group that has a higher infection rate right now are New Mexicans ages 18 to 34. Health officials do clarify that we are not seeing a rise in hospitalizations among New Mexico children. That goes against the national trend, but they do anticipate a rough couple of weeks coming up for hospitals based on recent COVID case counts. With not much space as it is, they estimate the state could need 700 beds for COVID patients by next week. But Human Services Secretary Dr. David Scrace says data indicates that cases could soon level off. It shows that the state's test positivity rate amid the recent surge is now at 7.6 percent, which is down from mid-August. One death is too many deaths. I think those of you who have been following the regular reports know they were now seeing three or four uh, some days and and hopefully, uh, you know, the projections are that could go up to six or 10 or as high as 15, but hopefully we will see that level off again soon. The state continues urging people to get the vaccine and for people who are immunocompromised to get the additional third shot and to free up more COVID testing slots as more people are getting tested. The state's recommending the at home vault self test or curative tests for people who have to get regular testing, either because they're unvaccinated or work in a congregate setting. Back to you. Okay, thanks, Jackie. Now, Dr. Christine Ross is also urging parents to get their kids vaccinated, especially kids who've already had COVID. She says it is safe to get the vaccine, even though it is rare to catch COVID twice.